Good morning. So today I want to ask whether you've surrendered yet. You know, surrendered to the reality that you have an addiction or that you love someone who has an addiction and that you really don't have <coughs> full control or really any control over what happens. Um, a favorite author of mine, Byron Katie, has a saying, you can argue with reality and you lose, but only 100% of the time. It's a great little saying because it sort of gets at the point that when you go up against something that you can't beat, then you're going to lose. And addiction is like that. In the 12-step philosophy, they say that you're powerless over your addiction. Well, that means that sooner or later you're going to lose control, that bad things are going to happen, and that you're not going to win that fight. So if the reality is you're not going to win that fight, and that you really do have this disease, and that you can't control it consistently, then the solution is to surrender, to let go, to fully, fully accept that you have this disease and you need to just stop fighting it. Again, in some 12-step meetings, they have a white chip, and so the saying is, give up the fight, pick up the white. A white chip meaning a sign of surrender, a sign that you're going to, just for today, not use drugs and alcohol and work a recovery program. It seems kind of counterintuitive that you that you give up the fight and, and start winning. But if you're up against something that you can't beat, then that's the only real solution. And once you fully accept that, then you can move on with your life and do all the other things. And the truth is we do that all the time with many things in life. I like using the example of gravity. We all accept that we're powerless over gravity, and so we don't fight it. We don't try to jump off tall buildings. We don't jump out of airplanes unless we've got a parachute. So we just accept that we can't beat gravity, so we move on with our life, and we don't stand too close to tall edges like the Grand Canyon in case we fall over, uh, but we find all the other fun things we can do in life without having to try to beat gravity. Addiction is exactly the same way. If you have the disease of addiction, you're not going to win, and so it's time to just give up and do everything you can to give up and, and, and move on with your life so that you find happiness in other directions because happiness was never there anyway, so what are you losing? Thanks.